Hello again, everyone. This is Katina from I'm the One Ministries. Um, this is going to be a shorter video. Uh, I am in the process of removing um, some eggplant seeds. So I had began, um, as you can see, um, yesterday I hadn't sauteed part of this eggplant to go with um, a vegetable wrap that I made. And so I worked my way around the uh, this, the part that had the seeds on it. You know, you, you really got a good part of the flesh that doesn't have any seeds. And then I believe here down at the bottom of the eggplant, you do have, you know, seeds there. So I never really paid attention to eggplant seeds at all until, you know what? when god brings your attention to what you need to have your attention brought to you will you will learn and so um it's not that much of a tedious process um but you know it it, it can be done i already have a set of um seeds that i've taken from an eggplant already um, so again, I believe in one of the last videos I talked about, you know, um, purchasing, this was an organic eggplant I picked up from, um, Whole Foods and, um, it was $2.99, uh, a pound. And so, um, I got, you know, this small, this small organic, um, eggplant for um a dollar what was it a dollar 79 i think i can't remember off the top see the dollars i think it was a dollar 79 um but as you can see you know i've already gone through a part of the eggplant so remember i said you know if you're gonna buy an eggplant buy an extra one you know get one to save the seeds or if you can work your way around it you know, you will have to spend some time doing it. And I believe that this is why, you know, again, not to take away from those who sell seeds, um, you know, because it is a business, um, they, you know, the, you know, they do have their prices and, you know, what they charge for, for seeds and, you know, rightfully so, um, you know, because when I shared in the supermarket, you know, why, you know, pay this amount for the, you know, seeds when you can, you know, just get an eggplant and do it yourself. Push come to shove. If you can't get to an eggplant, you better go pick up them seeds, no matter how much they cost and how many is in the pack. Um, but this is a, a little bit more economical, especially if you don't have the funds a dollar seventy nine, and you know, look how I already have. I don't know how many seeds here. So um, again, uh, the Lord has led me to do these videos. Um, these, you know, we got. He said, um, you know, seeds. You know, saving seeds, seeds you don't see, and seeds you don't see as seeds. <laughs> um, so he's really exposing you know, a lot here with respect to our food and waking, you know, waking us up and really giving us knowledge to where it's, it's just like, you know, when the, you know, the scripture says, seek him while he may be found. The, this is literally like a high and go seek process in itself because, um, first of all, you know, I've, cooked eggplant plenty of times and never regarded the fact that you know this part or even looking at it here that these are seeds I, I never really paid attention to it like that like ever ever and so now that I am and I have and I do you know and look at this this more and and see like this right here like there's like hidden gems you know, we better seek, you know, these seeds while, while they can, and they may be found. And just, if you can just, you know, we can spend the money on, 
doing these worldly things, we can, you know, again, <laughs> ain't going to be too much of, you know, that lifestyle left. If we can do those things that, you know, we did, you know, being in the world, we can, we can do this to preserve and, and not depend on, you know, again, Pharaoh to, to take care of us. Um, because it's going to put you in that position that you're not going to want to be in to where, you know, again, seek the Lord while we may be, while he may be found. We have a choice. And when you looking at the choice to where, you know, do this and take this so you can have that. And so you can have this, it's going to put you in a vulnerable, a vulnerable position and, you know, especially if you don't have people that's going to, you know, that is going to help you out, that can help you out. Um, or you, you just never know what stipulations even uh, the powers that be may put on uh, society to where it, it may not be easy, even if somebody can give them to you, give the seeds to you. Um, you know, that can probably even give you some, you know, um, again, I was, um, explaining about how some of the, um, utility patents and things like that on, on particular, you know, organic, because it is a product and foods, you know, it doesn't, it it doesn't give you like that. Uh, it doesn't give you that control to be able to give somebody seeds um, with somebody having a, a utility patent on food, on seeds, which is, it's just crazy. And so, you know, learning that, um, it's, it's definitely an eye opener. It opens your eyes. I don't think there's no seeds in here. It opens your eyes to um, what's been going on for so long or what, you know, what kind of society or, you know, where, what, what we're living in right now, um, whether it be society, whether it be you know, I don't know, environment, the world, what we're living in now. So I just, again, wanted to show you. Um, and as I get these, you know, seeds, and look at this, $1.79, and look how many more eggplant. And there's one right here on my finger. That's, this, is an, this right here is an eggplant, you all. That's one eggplant. That's literally... One of these from one seed. And so look how many I, I got here from this one eggplant. And so start getting, um, as the Lord is revealing to me um, how to get the seeds and where the seeds are, for, for especially for the foods that I eat, um, you know, um, Look at what you eat, and that's that's the crazy thing. Look at how you can tell um, what is good and what is evil. The the foods that's on the shelves, where are the seeds from them? Where how how are you gonna preserve any type of seeds from the foods that's on the shelves? It, you just. There's just no way. There's no way. Look at that right there. So, right there, that tells you that um, what's on the shelves is, you know, not approved not God proved anyway. You know, if you, if you can 
can and make your own things and, and get it on your own shelves, there you go. But you're not, you're not getting any seeds from anything that's not fresh. And as the Lord says, you know, don't eat from that tree of the knowledge of good and evil. Um, we can't let not one seed get away. We ain't, not one seed is going to be left behind. So I just wanted to show you, you know, not see some people, you know, they may, not, they may see this as tedious or just whatever have, whatever have you, um, and may not want to do it, but, um, this sure enough is definitely going to pay off in the long run. Um, I know I am going to have seeds available. Um, and um, when I get ready to need or grow or whatever have you and get into that final resting space that the Lord will have for me to get into and the land and I'll be able to grow and get it going. And um, I know this will be able to help many people. So um, I just wanted to give y'all this, not only this word, but give y'all this opportunity to like um, play hide and go seek. It's not hide, but seek while, you, while these seeds can be found. Oh, there's a seed right there. Um, we just going to learn together. We learn in this process together. Again, this was something I did not pay attention to, but, um, I'm paying attention now. I'm just going to get these seeds up out of here. This, this only turned brown. It's just like, a um, just like the apple or, um, potato. Um, it's, as I exposed it and opened it. Almost makes it harder for me to get to find these seeds, but just wanted to just share this with you. This process on removing the seeds from an eggplant and um, where they are. Again, the Lord says, um, you know, saving seeds, seeds you see, seeds you don't see, and seeds that you don't see as seeds. <laughs> Hallelujah! And so, uh, if uh, again, check out your beans, your rice. Um, these are things that you don't see as seeds. Everything that we eat, we're technically eating the seeds. Even corn, corn on the cob. The corn that's on the cob is actually a seed. And um, what was I saying in the last video about it being asexual? So, but, but you know, you got an asexual part of the plant of which the Lord is teaching me, and that's what I'm going to be revealing a lot in um, Save Your Own Seeds 103. Um, as the Lord is um, leading me and teaching me, um, I am doing a lot of um, research, and I'm learning a lot of this um, as I go along, and as I do, I'm going to show you and um, allow you to learn with me and so he wants us to be prepared and he wants us to be ready. And um, I want you to be ready too. So, and so we can be ready together. So this is an, an organic eggplant of which I picked up from Whole Foods. Um, and I am literally, 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 literally removing the seeds um, from the eggplant. And um, I don't know if I'm going to give these a rinse or not, but I'm going to just let them dry here, right here on this. Um, whoa. -oh. No, I said no seed left behind. I am going to let it dry right here on this. Um, on this. Cutting board mat. And I am going to. Um, yeah, get them in my handy dandy little brown, um, no, not brown, not brown paper bag, but my yellow little envelope. And I am going to um, write organic eggplant um, where it came from, Whole Foods, today's date, 2 2 2024. And um, yeah, um, if you want, 
you can take one of the seeds, stick it between a moist paper towel and stick it in a plastic Ziploc bag and, um, and let it germinate and just um, see, you know, see if it, you know, it's working. I'll rinse my knife back off here. Um, and so, yeah, so that's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna keep you updated and um, informed. And um, again, we are gonna take this journey together. So um, I pray that this video blesses you and uh, you are, um, knowing and growing and learning as I am. So again, we're going to learn together and um, have a blessed night. Take care. Bye.